What's up everybody, it's your boy JD back again with another video. You guys know what time it is. It's time to hop back in that lookism greatness. So, about to go ahead and get into it. See what's in store for us today, but before we do, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Want to take support any further? Patreon link is in the description below. Also, join our Top of Game membership and hit the notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a video or go live on the channel. So, let's go ahead and get into it, man. All right, so Gun is here. Gun is here. He wants the shit. Is Danny gonna give it to him? If you call him, that means you were right. Just as you said, Gun will show up here. Now that Gunner's location is confirmed, I'll start spending, oh, sending my people there as well. Using the red paper, Asbury to find out where Gun is is very clever. You were right on the money with that one, Eugene. Since Gun's made his move, I'll head over there too. I don't know what you have planned exactly, but I can't just sit back and watch Gun do as he pleases. So, you mean to fight him yourself? Do you think you can win? I couldn't end up losing. But either way, he and I never finished our fight last time. I need to see this through to the bitter end. I'm sure he feels the same way too. I wonder who would win, James Lee or Gunn. They're both not in their prime anymore. So I'm curious to see who has the upper hand. I would like to assume it will be Gunn just based on Gunn has been more active as far as fighting goes, but we don't know at both of their primes who was stronger. I'm assuming James Lee was stronger at his prime. So which that would then give James the upper hand, even though he hasn't been active. Are you serious? A fight to the death? And who is this gun kid anyway? Come on, spit. The heir to Japan's Yamazaki Syndicate. He and Charles Shore have been working together for years. To go into more detail, let me be the one to go over the details. Since it's the reason we need to take Gun down before Charles Choi. We do? Yes. According to the information Diego Kane gathered, Charles Choi recently began transferring his shares of H and H. The whole thing is being kept tightly under wraps, but the person receiving the shares is probably Gun. Doesn't Charles Choi have a daughter? They've been estranged for quite since. Wait, have they? Were we? I mean, because we haven't seen Crystal in like forever. Charles Troy would choose a loyal follower over someone who defies him, even if she is his own flesh and blood. And if that happens, it will be meaningless to go after Charles Troy. Go and inherit his fortune, and we will end up having to fight a younger, more powerful version of Charles Troy. That's why. Very impressive. Were you able to predict that I show up here too? Don't tell me Charles showed up, bro. I'm rather hurt by your actions, Eugene. Bro. Bro, the fact that Charles showed up to y'all little shindig. Woo. Do we have a double agent? Do we have a double agent, bro? Because I don't, I don't think he just knew the address. Like somebody sent him... He just found out the address all by himself. The only person I could see kind of being a double agent is James. But then the question would be, why is James working as a double agent? What is he gaining from being a double agent per se? Or was he never a double agent to begin with? That's the only person I could see if this is indeed the case. If it's not the case, then I'm very curious on how he found their location. Given that you and I were once on the same side. How far? I didn't think you, oh, I didn't think you deigned to come see us in person. Interesting. We were just talking about you. Charles Troy. Yeah, yeah, we knew it was Charles. Or should I call you Elite instead? Bringing up ancient history. Guess you really are out for my blood. It's not like you haven't been itching to come after me all this time. Rather, it's that you couldn't because you were afraid of me and my people. So I wonder, what's inspired this sudden streak of bravery in you? Unless you've, oh, unless you've got one hell of a trump card up your sleeve. You should be prepared to face the consequences of daring to cross me. 
do you not realize that you just walked into a lion's den? As a former street thug, you should know better than anybody that it'd be all too easy for us to do away with you now. I doubt it. Look, bro, Charles may be like 150 years old, bro. But that boy still can move, okay? He still can move. I think he could still take y'all. Even though, you know, he might he might crack a hip or so. Yeah, I think he could still take you. But you don't need to worry about that. I won't sink that low. I'm not some common thug like you. See, see that's the problem. <clears throat> Y'all don't want to sink low. You got to sink low with him. If this, if you really had a, if you really had a good thought in, in here that you can take him out right then and there, you should do it. If you, if you just had the, mm, if you really felt that y'all can end this shit right here and now, do it. Because the more you let him linger, the more he's just going to find different ways to outmaneuver you in the future. If you can get rid of your headache now, get rid of your headache now. Don't let him, don't let it fester. If you have, if you get, if you walk by something, you get cut and then you're like, oh, it's going to be fine. And then you just let it go, let it go, let it go. You don't do nothing to it. And then it gets infected and then you're going to be fucked. Then you about to die. See, see that? See, sometimes you got to get low, bro. Sometimes you just got to be like, fuck it. I just got to get dirty. Rather, there's something else you should be more concerned about. It's making its way over here as we speak. I hear something you'd be absolutely. Why are you spilling the beans? I mean, granted, I'm pretty sure Charles knew. But the fact that you're just like, oh, yeah, we got the red paper. What the fuck? Yeah, but it's like, yeah, we got the red paper. Ooh, like, bro, what are you doing? Why are you? Ooh, like, what What are we doing, bro? What are we doing, fam? Like, why are you doing that? Why are you just volunteering information that nobody asked you to volunteer, bro? Like, oh, yeah, we're going to have your red paper. Like, what? I mean, granted, yeah, he probably already knows about the shit, but it's just like, even if he didn't, he like, I would be like, why are you volunteering this shit? Don't do this, teacher. Oh, guns, guns compromise, bro. Yeah, and I don't need to fight. Oh, you and I don't need to fight. It's all over. Regardless of the outcome of this fight, Charles Troy will lose. You and I don't need to exchange blows over someone like him. You consider me your student, don't you? I don't want to ruin our relationship over this. Oh, that's nice. He gave us an umbrella. He probably gonna try to hit us next. Daniel Park. Teacher. Don't trust that shit, Daniel. When are you gonna quit yapping and start fighting? See? <clears throat> See? The die was cast. The moment I accepted you as my student. Choose. Daniel Park. Will you kill me or will you be killed by me? More, he said, or oh, will you be killed? But I like killed by me instead. Sounds a little more ominous to me. Fine. I'll fight to keep the red paper safe. Why are you, why are your eyes closed? <clears throat> why are your eyes closed, bro? Why the fuck, why is your eyes closed? That's it. Daniel, like, why is your eyes closed, bro? <sighs> this man's eyes really was closed. A powerful enemy has gotten a hold of you first. What did I teach you to do in this situation? Whatever you did, you, you did a horrible job because he's not doing it. You said to use that power to my advantage. Very good. Mister, get out of here. I'll handle things here. Get the red paper to a safe place quickly. I need to hurry. Not a ch the, f the fact that gun speed. This man instant transmission to the truck. Gun instant transmissioned to the fucking truck as this man was driving hit him knocked him out bro that's crazy that's insane bro 
That's insane, bro. You jumped all the way from over there. Bro, you just did the same shit. You truly are my masterpiece. What? What do you think you're doing? Daniel Park. The fact that this jacket I can't get and this jacket is still fucking sold out, bro, and it's never coming back hurts me. Hurts me, bro. It Like, dead ass, bro. If y'all know where I can get this jacket, obviously I can't get it from PTJ itself because he's not putting the jacket back in stock. He's not... As far as I know, he's not selling this jacket anymore. It's been like a year and his jacket is not coming back, apparently, from just me monitoring. So if y'all know where I can get this jacket, bro, um, definitely let me know in the comments. Hit me up in Discord. I really want this jacket. Like, I really want this hoodie, bro. Like, dead ass. I really want it. Like, I've seen, like, knockoffs here and there. But I don't really trust the sites that they're on. And the ones... And the size I do trust, it don't have it in the back. It has it in the front. And I'm like, ew. I'm like, at least put it in the back. Or at least give me the option to put the, you know, markings and logos and shit in the back. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's like, I'm like, even if I was trying to get the knockoff, like a knockoff version, like, it's, they put it in the front. They don't put it on the back. So I'm like, it's kind of useless. Now that we're teacher and student, I should greet you properly. I'm looking forward to learning from you. You're really something else. He's strong. No shit. The fact that Daniel like, ee! Daniel got the face like, ooh, that shit hurt. He got the face like, ooh, that shit hurt. Gun like, eh. <laughs> Gun got the face like, eh. Bit by bit, I'm losing ground. He's relentless. I need to gain the upper hand here. That's it. Show me everything you've got. I'm gonna be the dog shot of Daniel right now. Throw everything you have into this fight. Leave no regrets. Whoa, what's all this? Sushi? You know how to make sushi? Diet is a part of training. Still, a whole tuna? Eat up before it gets cold. Is it not already cold? Like, bro, you're, you're cutting a tuna live, which is fine. But isn't this shit already cold? Okay, before it gets cold, sushi isn't a hot food. Right. <laughs> I'm like, isn't sushi already cold? Whatever. And he calls me an idiot. Wait a minute. What is it? Come to think of it, I'm not sure how to address you. What do you mean? Can I call you teacher? Daniel Park. You are worthy. You deserve the right to kill me. Can he though? Just because he deserves the right to doesn't mean he necessarily can kill you. No. I can't keep trading blows with him like that anymore. At this rate, I'll collapse before he does. Boy, you are already down on bending knee. What do I do? He's my teacher. Tired already. He knows me too well. I didn't teach you to be tired in the middle of a fight. There's only one solution. I don't think that shit gonna work. To use techniques he never taught me. You're gonna try and beat me by using techniques I'm not familiar with. A single strike. Go ahead. He like, you know what? This is actually interesting. I want to see you try. He like, I want to see you try. Yes, please try it out. I want to see how this goes. 
I have only one shot at this. I'm staking everything on this one blow. Something I didn't learn from you. James Lee, isn't this James Lee move? Yo, imagine if Daniel like grabs his wrist and breaks that shit. Like in this position, bro, that shit would be insane. Not G-Chong Kwok's hand blades. Obviously, that's not what he's going for, but I'm just saying, if he was, that shit would be epic. But unpredictability. Who the hell has a loud ass truck that fucking loud? Jesus. Dead ass. Like, Bro, even I had, you know what? I apologize for that. People just have no regards for me. They just don't care. All right. <clears throat> the fact, wait, the fact that he even had his arm, used his other arm, caught Daniel's elbow, brought his arm back down, or at least brought it his arm through where Daniel's legs were, brought it up, and now about to strike. Yo, that's crazy. That's crazy, though. That's crazy, though. Daniel like, yeah, that's going to be about it for me. Daniel like, that's going to be about it for me. I'll give that a 72 out of 100. That technique will need further refining, I think. Now, I'll be taking the red paper. Red paper. That's your big trump card. You are too complacent. You should have sent every single fighter there instead of bringing them here. The red paper. I'm not worried about that. Gun. Should have it in his hands by now. Oh, wow. Who are you again? <clears throat> ain't, ain't no way I'm about to think he's going to survive this shit, bro. Can't, can't to know, bro. No, bro. I'm not. I'm not about to buy that bullshit. Oh, he said more people there. Okay. He sent Cosmo and Kenta there. Who else he sent there? It did James make it? Oh, okay. James did not make it, but he sent Dosu and um, Chain. Okay. More people? Wait, we have more people? Seth Lee and Jin Jane. So Eugene sent everybody. Eugene, like all of y'all go, bro. Every single last one of y'all. I'm not sparing no expense. I'm not giving him a second. I want all of y'all to go and take y'all ass over there to fight gun and get that red paper, bro. Honestly, I, gun was. I still give gun the advantage. I still think gun is gonna beat their ass. I'm sorry. I'm. I am well aware of just how powerful a fighter he is. After all, that one man nearly wiped out the workers. Oh, nearly wiped the workers out of existence. Which is why things will be different this time around. I will succeed no matter what, even if it takes every single member of the workers to make that happen. That man sent everybody. He sent the whole force. He like, I don't care what y'all doing. I don't care if you was clapping cheeks. I don't care if your mama has cancer and is dying in the hospital. I don't care if your daddy just fell down the flight of stairs and broke his hip. I don't care if your grandmama slipped and fell in the middle of the street during, during high oncoming traffic. You bring your ass over here and you whoop guns ass. That's pretty much what Eugene told all of these people. I don't care. I don't care what you was doing. I don't I don't care. You get your ass up, you bring your ass over here, and you whoop gun ass for me. 
Like, but the fact that Eugene is like moving like that, like I don't care about none of your other problems, bro. Like you come over here. Like I, I hope none of them was doing something crazy or got some crazy other family life going on in Eugene. Like I don't give a damn, bro. I put put that shit on the back burner, bro. Like dead ass. Put that shit on the back burner. If she was dying, she gonna die anyway. Like say your goodbyes while you're there and get your ass over here. It's kind of messed up. It's kind of messed up, and yes, I'm headcanning that, but that's not the point. The point is that Eugene's like, bring your ass over here. That's a lot of people. Like, even, even though I'm going to be real, let us put everything on the line. Even though I'm going to be real, I'm going to be real. Even though that is a shit ton of people, Gun is still going to whoop their ass. I I don't think these people are going to take down Gun, even though they might injure him. They might injure him and tire him out. But do I really think all of these people are going to take gun down? Hell no. A battle to decide all of our face. The hunt for gun. I'm, I'm just not. You just not about to. Make, we've been, gun has been hyped up since the beginning of this fucking series. The very beginning of this series. This man has been hyped up. And you really want me to think and believe. That gun is going to be taken out by these fodder. Let's be real. Yes, numbers are vast, but at the end of the day, the man is still smoking a cigarette with one hand in his pocket. They are fodder, okay? They are fodder, and they will die. If he don't kill them, majority of them gonna be knocked out, if not dead. So I'm, you're just not about to convince me otherwise. It's not gonna, these people are not gonna do it. They, they're not, they're just not. It's either gonna be James, it's gonna be Daniel, it's gonna be somebody of higher status. It's not it's not gonna be these people bro so i mean it's it's cool that you know eugene is just rallying every single last person he has for this i mean that's 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 some g stuff that is some g stuff but at the same time i'm not just i'm not about to sit here and pretend like i'm really worried for gun safety i'm i'm just not it i'm not i'm not it, i'm not now if you telling me like then maybe show even though even if van zach Johan, you know, all of our guys showed up. I still wouldn't be worried for gun. I still wouldn't be. I, I just wouldn't be. I, I mean, I need I need some big time people. Like, give me some big time people. That's the only way I'm gonna be like, oh, gun might, gun might get his issue. Nah, boy, he might get his issue. not really doing it but that's it for today's video man hope you guys enjoy you did make sure to drop a like sub to the channel let me know what you guys think about everything that happened in the comment section below also you guys want to keep up with me twitch twitter discord links all of that is in the description as well um before i go before i go if you guys clicked off by now it makes sense um if you didn't click off by now stay real quick i know i've been seeing a couple people say yo why haven't you you know been reading it you know more lookism um like it's on chapter 415 or not 415 like 515 or 513 14 whatever chapter the hood scans are on right okay so i'm a, i'm i'm assuming a lot of you are new which is fine so i'm about to give you this tidbit if you're still here if you're not still here i'm going to say it on the next video I can't do that, okay? I'm gonna tell you the reason why. The reason why I can't do that is mainly because, one, I have a partnership with Neighbor. So, by having a partnership with them, I can only do what's on the official website, which the official website is currently the chapter you see today, 504. Yes, I know there are more chapters out there. Yes, I know that if I can go to this site, that site, that site, this site, I can read all of those chapters. Yes, I know this. Trust me, I do. And that goes for not just Lookism, but every other series on the channel. Yes, I know there are more chapters I can go read other places. However, contractually, I am not allowed to do so. If I do, one, they will consider it stealing. Two, my channel will be taken down because they will strike the living hell out of me. And three, I will not be doing YouTube anymore because this is like my third channel I've re you know I had to start over from and I'm not doing it again. I'm I'm dead ass. I'm probably not going to do this shit again. Like dead ass. Y'all don't know how rough it is 
starting over and over and over and over again. That shit is, it's draining. And I have like over 2000 videos on this channel. Yes, I have like majority of my videos like saved on like hard drives and shit, for example. But just the, the hours of work I put into it, the amount of thumbnails that I don't have anymore. Cause if you got notice, there's some videos on the channel that don't have thumbnails and I just don't feel like making them all over again or getting them made and spending money to get them made. Like it's just not, it's, it's not, it's not worth it. So that is the reason. I hope you understand the reason. It's nothing I can do about it. I'm fine with just being current, you know, on officials. Does it suck? I don't know everything that's going on in the future and that you, you know, I want to be like completely up to date. Sure. But at the same time, I got to do what I got to do, man. Y'all know, y'all know how it is. You know, you, you go to work. You don't want to work. You don't want to do what your boss tells you. But unfortunately, you got to do what you got to do. Now, granted, I can be like, fuck the contract and go ahead and do what I want to do. It wouldn't be, you know, on the main channel. I can tell you that much. It'll be on Patreon or something if you want to see that. However, I don't feel it's necessary right to do that because even if I do do it, I still wouldn't be able to put it on the main channel because they can tell when it's not on their official site. So, you see what I'm saying? It's, it just doesn't matter. So I best might as well just do what I'm supposed to do and that'd be it. But now that I got the way, catch you guys next time. Peace.